There are two types of quench columns. The traditional single section style is simply one large tower. Cold water enters at the top and flows downward. As the gas is cooled, water is quenched and joins the circulating liquid. The water exiting the bottom of the tower is higher in both volume and temperature. A portion of this water is purged to the sour water stripper, and the rest is cooled and returned to the top of the tower. Tray and packed columns are both used, but packing is more common. The second type of quench tower has a two-section design. It is known as a D-superheater contact condenser. The bottom section is meant to drop the gas temperature to its water dew point but not below. The water in the bottom section has no cooler. It just continues to circulate. Therefore, the water can become very hot over time. Some designs will artificially raise the pH of the lower section water to act as an SO2 or sulfur scavenger. When the water flows into the upper section, this is the actual quench column where cooled water lowers the temperature of the gas and quenches water from it to prepare it for the amine absorber.